another week which means another weekly ascending challenge here in the dreaming city this week the challenge is over in the spine of kiri's area which is off to the left hand side of the map you'll find the portal right here but first make sure you grab the bounty from petra she is over in the Devalian mist so it's really easy to spawn in here grab the bounty and then make your way across this series of islands past the oracle offering and then you'll find the portal right here now you can only see the portal if you have a tincture of queen's foil so make sure you have one of those before you get this thing started before i jump in i do want to say that we are one week away from the crown of sorrow raid i would love for you guys to come back for the live stream here on youtube as myself and my fire team make our best efforts to get worlds first so if you're not subscribed it would mean the world to me if you guys could subscribe and then come back for that cool event so hopefully i can hit 25,000 subscribers before then but it would make me really happy for you guys to come back if you've watched these videos and found them helpful so with that said we're going to jump right in here let's jump in the portal and we will go ahead and try to get the eggs the lure and this challenge complete all in one fell swoop so the first thing you notice when you come in we need to make our way all the way to the very top. That's where we're gonna find the boss and that's where we're gonna find our destiny. But to do that, we have to traverse this difficult platforming section. You'll notice that there is a bunch of the taken wipeout portals and we know how bad those things can be. But let's do our best to navigate these treacherous waters as we head upwards and onwards. Aside from the portals, there can also be the taken bombs and I think those are a bit easier to navigate than are these portals but that's all right let's make our way upwards once we get this thing done then we'll look for the lure and the eggs i'll try to point them out as we go and i will have a timestamp as well for those respective challenges so let's do our best here to avoid these portals because they can really easily mess you up We're going to keep going upward. Basically, that's what you want to do is keep going up. You notice that in my mini-map there, there is a red enemy that we can see at some point. He is a sniper. There's going to be some snipers here. You might want to take them out because they will do a lot of damage to you. And there's also going to be some shadow thralls once we get pretty far on one, too. We got some rotating platforms and there's wipeout portals. Let's jump over to this spot right here. It's kind of safe. And we'll look for those enemies. Oh, there he is take him out now the the bones are on one of these statues it's behind a hand and I don't see the bones right there so that to me says it's on the other statue and we can look at that in a second but that's where you're going to find the lore piece let's take him out there's another guy right over here but this is what I'm more worried about this little portal thing Yeah. Alright, now that he's taken care of, we're gonna find the lore right over here, behind this hand. This is where you're gonna find the lore. I know I've already collected it, but that's where you're gonna find the lore piece, behind that statue. I know it is a account base, so once you grabbed it, you can't grab it on another character. Otherwise, I would have played on a different character and showed you guys exactly where it is. So let's keep going up and onwards. We're getting close to the end. Once we get to a certain point, we're going to see the Shadow Thralls start to spawn. We're also close to the one egg, which is over yonder, I think. But that's right. We'll look at it in more detail once we've completed this challenge. There's the first egg. The second egg is actually really close to this one, in this final area. There's only two eggs in this area. Alright, let's jump across here. Let's see exactly what's waiting for us. Shadow Thralls are one thing, but we also have a boss, which is very much like the Lake of Shadows boss. There he is. Let's use our Blade Barrage and try to get some of them right there. Took down half his health, that's pretty good. We can take him out with this. I think we'll be in pretty good shape. But he took away all of our ammo. Or all of our super. That's not a big deal. Alright. We'll take him down. Once he's defeated, everything else will despawn. And then the chest will appear. As always, grab that chest quick because it will despawn way faster than you might think. 
we got our queen skull back which is good we got our bounty done which is better and we also have some armor which will help us out in future runs here so let's go ahead and we'll turn the bounty in this will be powerful gear and obviously this will help you get to level 750 once opulence comes out so we got some more boots we actually got a nice amount of armor here then we have a helmet we got the chest piece we have the boots now even though they want the postmaster no big deal all right so we saw that first egg down here the other egg is actually straight up above you may see it. it's hard to see but it's straight up above right here from where we're at now you can only break that is if you have the wish ender but that's where the second and final egg is here for this ascending challenge right at the very end and you can see it is immune just to show really quick before we leave that other egg is right down here and we'll get a better view at it from over here I think there it is all right so here's the other egg so two eggs here the other the lore piece is behind the statue's hand and that will complete everything for this if you're going for the time challenge definitely it's a lot easier with a fire team and certainly it's a lot easier when it's the taking bombs and not the wipeout portals everybody thank you so much for watching please please make sure you come back for the crown of sorrow raid i cannot wait to do that super hyped for that i will link as well the trailer breakdown that i did there's a really cool trailer that just came out for that new season so would love to see you guys and see what your thoughts are on that most importantly though thank you for watching we'll catch up soon and have a great reset see you guys